Hello friends, I've recorded this video to show you that in spite of all the experience that you may have, a soft gummy cataract can sometimes create a lot of heartache in its management. This was a very important patient who opted for cataract surgery in my hands and this turned out to be a soft cataract. The patient was a diabetic. So after performing the capsulorexis, I really did not foresee any problems having handled many such cases. So I tried to do the hydro dissection and I see a nice hydro dissection wave. However, on attempting the hydro delineation, which I'd like to do in softer cataracts, I found that the hydro delineation wave did not happen very well. In spite of this, I decided to go ahead with doing the soft chop technique where I use low power and high vacuum to hold the nucleus and then try to crack and chop it. So the first thing I do is I try to impale the nucleus using very low power but a reasonably high vacuum and I'm able to get my first job. But then when I do the subsequent handling of the nucleus, I found that there was a lot of cheese wiring that was happening in spite of the extremely low power of just 20%. Because of the cheese wiring, the vacuum didn't kick in and I was not able to pull in the nucleus firmly into the FACO probe. And this continued till I ended up eating up small chunks and small pieces of the soft gummy cataract and eventually ended up with a crater formation. This just goes to show that the soft cataracts will prove to be a challenge even in the most experienced of hands under certain circumstances. There are several options of handling the soft cataract. You can use a horizontal chop using a blunt chopper, go to the periphery. That is one technique. But I would like to tell you a fail-safe method that works almost always in my hands and that is to use viscoelastic substance to create a visco dissection and this wave of viscoelastic will lift the nucleus up. Once the nucleus is tilted up and lifted out of the capsular bag, then it becomes a child's play to handle this lens. And immediately the tension is diffused and the management continues along predictable lines. Of course, you can use fluid also. You can use hydro dissection also to elevate and lift the lens out of the capsular bag. But a viscoelastic substance like hydroxypropyl methyl cellulose having a much higher viscosity is more likely to do the job and lift up even a thick plate of soft cataract. So you're more likely to succeed in creating the elevation and the lift of the nucleus out of the capsular bag if you were to use a viscoelastic rather than just simple fluid. So before you try any other technique of handling the soft cataract, if you end up with a crater formation, first try the visco lift and if that fails, then you can use a horizontal chop or other maneuvers in order to handle this cataract. I thank you for your attention.